Welcome back everyone. We're on Elm Creek map on Farming Simulator 22. I'm Jewel and on the last episode we were trying to sell the crop to on the train to uh, one of the other places that you can sell at and it would never work. So as you can see here apparently now that I've restarted the game it's working. Uh, I haven't done anything since I left the game but I will say this. Uh, I was right in what I was doing and it did call the train. I just didn't wait long enough. So if you saw the last episode, uh, you, you understand what I'm talking about. Uh, but basically they changed it from Farming Sim 19, I think. Uh, at least in 17 they did for sure. But um, now that you, you can't just drive the trains, like hop in them when, you know, you have to call it and rent it and all this, that and the other thing. So now I'm in this train and now I need to see if it'll let me just drive I don't think it it didn't load it obviously it was returned to the other side of the map whatever okay kick me out of the train whatever and you charged me for it and didn't do what I needed fine okay so what the deal is is this little spot here is where you rent the train and then once the train comes you can get in it And then you can put it under here, under the wherever the, the load area is. And you can load the stuff that you put in the, uh, the uh, silo. So basically, I didn't put it in this silo. So I don't know why they're here. I don't know why the train was here. So I didn't get to see that uh, on screen. So I'm going to run. Let me see. I'm gonna try to tab back and see where we can get. I might just have to go there. Um, let me go there on the map, and you'll go to the world, and you'll find the area, and it should be over here. So I was here. So let's visit this place. This is where I put it, I believe. Let me see. Yeah, and I had run over here. And I had emptied the trailer contents in here. And then I came over here and s clicked on this. At first it wouldn't click. And then finally it said something about rent. But it never did send a train. And apparently it sent it eventually. Ooh, I found a toy. Wow, wasn't looking for that, but okay. Uh, hello? Do I have to crouch on the ground to get it? Okay. It's not letting me. I'll worry about it later. Okay. So we hit R. Okay, I guess it's something's not right. Is it jammed? R. Okay, so it leased it. Uh, it says two dot negative for the vehicle leasing. I'm going to hit it again just in case. And it should be sending me a train, and I don't have... Oh, let me see. Here it is. Okay, no wonder. I couldn't see it before. So you hit R. It says it's $1,000 per hour. So, and I hit that again just to make sure. It says the train is going to arrive soon. Now, let me explain something. My, uh, the box on the left-hand top corner up there was not... I don't believe it was visible and I had it off because I like to turn it off sometimes so if you don't have that on and you like I don't see any of that hit F1 on the keyboard and it'll come back up and that's how you can turn it back off if you don't want it on the screen so hit F1 and it goes off hit F1 and it comes on okay and that's why I didn't see that to see that it said it'll arrive soon and I never saw that so I was like what are they doing so that was the last episode so now we're got to stand around and wait on this train to come when it comes we get in it and drive it over here to this then we can dump the stuff in there you gotta load it up then we'll send it off whichever direction it's I don't know which direction it's gonna come I'm hoping it comes from this way so I can drive right here but either way, then they'll s we'll send it off to, I guess, Goldcrest Valley and it'll sell it. So that's what we were trying to do on last episode and was unable to because I didn't see the information there because of the dialog box was not appearing because I had it off. So 
Be sure to have that on so you won't get so confused when you're doing certain tasks. If you're running into problems, make sure to turn it on real quick. Peek at it, see what it says. Usually you can figure it out if you can see what it says. So, now I've got to stand around and wait for the train. And that's the part I don't like. I think that's kind of dumb. I think that the train should be available. We shouldn't be waiting around all day on it. Uh, here it comes. Here comes the train. Alright, come on. There's an X in your way. Yeah, don't hit the X. Yeah, I'm not allowed over there, so you shouldn't be. What are you doing over there? Uh, really? Really? Oh, just drive through the X, why don't you? Okay, you gonna stop? Let me in. Now you gotta hit E to get in it. And now we're driving it, okay? Just like you do your other stuff, just press forward and I'm gonna push over. I don't know if you had to, but I'm sure you do. And uh, get in this line here. And as you can see, we have to open up the cover once we get here. And I'll tell you about that. And you gotta, I might have to back up if it, I'm holding the stop, but it just, it's not, not stopping. So I'm gonna have to back up because they're being a pain. All right. So once we get here, okay, all right. We're gonna be playing, playing games here over and over again. Come on. So you're gonna get this lined up with your first one. That should be good enough. Stop. All right, we're gonna open up. It says N is open. You're gonna open it up. And some of you may be having trouble uh, with it opening. Some somebody I saw on another video said when you hit that, sometimes it opens the third one and you have to do the other one. But in my case, it opened the correct one. Uh, they said then if that happens, just click it on t to open the third one and it would open the first one. Whatever the case, I don't know. Haven't had to do that. So now we need to select what we got, and we obviously only have one thing. So we're gonna hit R, and we have barley. That's what we put in here trying to sell. So we're gonna hit start, and it's gonna load up, as you can see. And then, wow, that was quick. <laughs> Not much is in there. Wow, that's a wasted trip. Okay, next time we will definitely load this up more before we sell it. Okay, so now that it's full, I suppose. We can close this up with N, and we're going to drive on down to the next area. So let's just head on down, and, and you can just read your stuff if you think you need to, but it ain't nothing that's needed right now. Da -da -da. Okay, see the scenery, wonderful. And you go on down to where you're going to get to the end of the map. So just keep on moving. And I'm going to take that down for a minute. Oh, I did not want to get out. Get me back in there. No. That is not good. Don't hit E. I accidentally hit E. That was a mistake. So hopefully they let me back in it. There's the other one that you can uh, open. I mean, rent a train at don't hit E. I accidentally hit that. Okay, sorry about that. <laughs> yeah, don't hit E. It's right next to W, so that's why I did accidentally did that. Alright, so I am using the keyboard on this one uh, today. So, alrighty. So move on down, 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 and then once we get there, we can send it on its way to sell. But I don't like that. I liked driving it and doing whatever I wanted to do and 17 that's my memory of it so i'm surprised they changed it i don't particularly like the change that's just me so i think the train should be able to be popped into with the tab and you go right to, to work whatever you want to do i did not want to turn on that but okay whatever all right train will drive to goldcrest and return on the other side of the map do you want to tr train to sell it yes hit yes and we just made our money see 3969 for the harvest and we minus 98 for the vehicle leasing since since we didn't use it an hour which was a thousand dollars an hour we only had to pay what we used it for this is the other one to rent a train here and there was one more we passed on the way and obviously you load inside here there's three places to do that oh my bad I, 
that's not true. You load over here. Or unload, excuse me. I don't know why I said load. Unload here. And then you can load, actually. It's up there. So you unload here, send it on the train from that little spot we just showed you, and wait for it, and then send it off. And if you got some in here, you can store your grain in here. And if you don't have room in your silo, and then just come back and get it or whatever, or transfer it from one to the other. Say your farm's right here, and you keep filling it up, and then it gets full, and you don't got no more room, and you don't want to drive your truck to the other one. Just load up the train and send the train, and then you dump your stuff in here. But anyway, so that's what's going on. Have a look around. All right. So we've sold it. We got our money. We need to head back. Um, since we don't have a vehicle anymore here, I think I need to. I do need to pick up my vehicle from where we were. So let's go ahead and do that. And enter the vehicle. And we can head on out of here. But appreciate all the new subscribers. I hope you've been enjoying all the different games I've been playing. I've been having a little bit of trouble with my Wi-Fi. And I apologize for that. And let's, uh, hopefully that it'll, it'll get worked out pretty good soon. I'm not sure where I am. Let's make us, make us up where we're big. Okay. So. Hmm. So if I turn go this way we'll be heading closer to home so that's so what I'm gonna do come on up over all this stuff follow the curve and off we go so let's shrink this down oh hitting the wrong button my bad all right now we're back to where we're going to the farm see what we got to do um, if you haven't already, hit the like button. If you like the video, it helps me know which ones you like, and I'll try to play more of them. And if you haven't subscribed, please consider doing so. It does help the channel grow, and it uh, helps me know everybody's wanting to see more, and I'll, I'll continue to make videos, so I appreciate it. And uh, basically, the Wi-Fi problem, I had a bad storm, and I don't know what happened. If it's the box now, I'm looking into getting a new box to see about fixing it if, it if that's the problem if that's not it i'll have to see what else i can do uh but it keeps going in and out in and out and uh, it's hard to upload a video now i don't know what in the world happened it was working fine and then just all kind of craziness and it's strange it all happened after i uploaded that 2k resolution video meaning a uh, better quality video of ranch simulator and so and it was took forever to upload that and so I don't know. I'm gonna. I had to change it back down to a, a, a lower resolution, and um, I have a couple of videos that I had recorded. I have two Gold Rush videos I need to get out, but I might have to edit them because I was trying to show it from start to finish on the winter cleanup of what you got to do with all the equipment because it's a lot you have to do, and I was wanting to show you in one video. Well. The video just the Wi-Fi is just not letting it upload for whatever reason. I've done tried several times. It gets about halfway done and just it never seems to finish. And so I don't know what I'm gonna do, but I might edit it if I can. If not, I don't know what to do. I may have to uh, make a, just make another video and skip that one. But I'm gonna try to edit it and get it where it's reasonable, where you can understand it hopefully. And uh, let's go ahead and stop this over here. Let's unload that. Where's our baler? It's over here. Look, we got to start baling, I guess. So we'll do some baling in this one. And uh, on the ranch simulator, I did about, I think it was six videos. I'm not sure. Getting prepared while I was in there on the 2K resolution. So I don't know. I'm having to try to get them up and they don't want to upload. I'll try again and see if I can get it done. If not, I might have to get download a program to maybe that lets me change the um, the uh, resolution or whatever something to where I can get it to work and the, with the Wi-Fi till I get my new Wi-Fi or whatever the box or whatever so let's turn this on and get going if you remember if you don't have it up oops I forgot to lower it so now we gotta hit V to lower it and if you can't see it just turn this on you can see everything's on so it should work now there we go I don't know what in the world this thing's doing there we go 
So, but now I'm gonna turn that off since I don't I don't like it up there if it's not being used. Uh, but anyway, I hope everybody's enjoying your day. Uh, t t uh, pretty s pretty much, it's probably just past the Fourth of July by the time this video goes up, or it's actually it might be the fourth of july when i post this video to be honest we'll have to see if happy fourth of july if it is uh for those that are in the united states and if it's not uh happy late fourth of july but i think it should be posted on that day hopefully uh we'll see what happens but um appreciate everybody and uh we're gonna be getting all these these bells done and then try to get on the next episode if we don't have time on this one we'll try to get that other field harvested pretty quick because we need to get it done while it's available and then we need to get these seed, uh these fields ready and get um lime down and get the stones out while we can when it's when we get all this up so we can do it properly and get it weeded properly so we get a lot of money for our crops i don't know why this is acting up there we go Alrighty, so now we'll do that, and I'm still going to be working on the map. Uh, like I say, there was some Giants Editor stuff that happened uh, with the Giants Editor. There's a new Giants Editor out, and it's 9.0.3, so you need to go on and download that if you do map making or intend to ma do map making. Um, I don't think you need to get the other ones if you have that but whatever you want to do get the other ones I would get them I would get all of them just to have I mean but the 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 9.0.2 one uh, the the update they had done on the game messed it up where there was no foliage on the map uh, on the in the editor so so do that. Uh, I have a video showing you where to go to get that stuff and to get paint.net and to get notepad plus plus so check that out and it it uh they are all free so uh if you run into trouble with the paint.net saying it costs money there is a paid version but the the where i told you to go is a free one you just got to make sure you follow the right prompts and if my i mean i didn't show myself downloading it because i already had it but if you run into trouble after you get to the site you if you can't get it to download to the free one just go look it up on YouTube again the paint.net how to download it and uh, there are pl uh, videos out there other people have made that show the actual step-by-step -step when you download it I just showed where to get it uh, but you know it's, it's some people have problems with it saying uh, that it costs like $4.99 or something and it don't I mean it does if you get in that particular version but um, if you if you follow the right steps it's free so i um, i mean i don't know i don't remember what it was what i had to click because i i'd already had it so i wasn't going to re-download it but um i did tell you about how to what where to go to get it which which was the correct link to get to it so check that out and those are some things you need to do map making and honestly map making you know there are difficult parts of map making you know not everybody knows everything there's some that might know quite a bit but uh, most people only know what they know and then each other people know a little more and then everybody kind of helps one another out on these uh, map stuff so don't be intimidated by the map making program is what I'm trying to get at just just try it like anything else we're running over the bell okay just give it a try uh, take your time learn a little at a time it's not that bad it's you know you make it worse by when you look at it because you just don't know everything yet but just take one piece at a time and learn that and you will you'll know more than you realize very quickly it's not that bad so it's basic concepts once you learn those you, you can kind of troubleshoot a lot of other stuff that you didn't know just because you learned a couple other things so and if you look on the GDN website where you get when you download the uh, ability to use the map uh, editor the Giants editor you can find tutorials there as well that help you and then there's a lot of tutorials uh, on YouTube which I have quite a few 
for 19 on uh, my channel. But I'm fixing to have some for 22. I'm just now getting going. I was looking at the the map at stuff to try to get pick out a map that I want to do. All right, we're gonna have to get out so we can get this track, this harvester out the way. Oh, really? Come on. Just get out the way, man. All right, there you go. Happy. All righty, let's hop in. Now, so I gotta back up so I can get this. Just want to get this last little bit here now. Come on now. Let me get it. Oh, it ain't going to be on. There we go. Alright, I think I got everything. I don't like leaving. Oh, there's a little bit there. Then we'll get these picked up. And we'll probably call that an episode once we get this. And uh, focus on other things on um, the next one like harvesting and getting this field ready to plant so we'll be doing lime and doing stone picking and so everything we need to do to get it ready so stay tuned for that um we're gonna pick up all these bells on this one probably um but yeah we're gonna get it going we're gonna try to get this map working good uh oh oh finally the bell fell out really Really? Okay. There we go. Alright, so we picked it all up. We're going to go park this over here. Out of the way, which we need to get us a place to park some of this. I'm not sure. I really don't. I think they should have gave us a little bit of room uh, to put something. Uh, we could put it here, but then we're blocking our beautiful barn, which I'm not interested in doing. So I'm going to pull it up beside the barn probably going to be the best place for it and let it go there and hop out now you could use the trailer to load all this or just come up to it pick it up and then run it wherever you want it to be so I'm just gonna run it in here I suppose and if you wanted you can climb the stairs and put the bells up there but I really don't see any point in that and just drop it these doors on here shut and open if you haven't seen that and there's a whole bunch of other things that you can do so let's go get the bells real quick I guess we'll start with the furthest ones and then work our way in that's probably a smart thing to do okay keep grabbing it try to center yourself when you grab it so that when you drop it, it you could stack it better but if you haven't checked out my channel, I have a lot of different games. I play Ranch Simulator, Gold Rush the Game, Trader Life Simulator, Farming Simulator 19 and 22. Uh, I make map making tutorials. I have a Jules Peaceful Valley map I've been working on for Farming Simulator 19. And I, like I said, I'm fixing to be doing a 22 map when I find one of the United States somewhere in there that I want, uh, like a state that I want to do. I'm going to try to do that. If, if I can't seem to get everything to go and work out properly with what I'm going to see, my Wi-Fi is a problem now and I need to download some stuff. And I'm having trouble even downloading. I couldn't even load the mod hub. I was going to download a, some mods and it would never load. So I've really got to figure out what's going on with that and hopefully uh, get that squared away so I can get the rest of this done. Uh, but I want to do a real world uh, state uh, map uh, for the game so and then of course it's not going to be perfect because I'm not going to have all the buildings that you would see but I'll try to put like a building where a building is a house where a house is you know it might not look exact but now I do have blender but like I say uh, I don't have time to do everything it's either going to be map making or me messing around in blender which i've done blender i did my uh water plane on blender for my farming sim 19 map so i know how to do some stuff i just haven't really got in there much i barely even got in there honestly so and i'm pretty good at figuring things out because i literally had been on, in there only like i would say 30 minutes or so no more than an, probably an hour or so 
certainly not more than that probably less than that to be honest and I figured out how to do the water plane I watch tutorials and then I just go along and figure it out and if there's things I don't know I just keep clicking on stuff reading it seeing what it is and just figure it out so uh, so I figured out a lot of things I don't know everything obviously got a lot to learn in blender if I'm ever gonna really do anything in there like buildings and all the other things which some of it's probably not that hard to be honest but it's just a matter of taking the time to do it look at it and I have not done that I just did enough to know that I got my water plane and that's kind of all I did so I should have did a video on it to be honest excuse me when I when I was doing it because that would have been nice because then it, not only would it have showed y'all it would have been just something to keep for me to have in my memory of what I did what steps I took so it's always good to record what you're doing when you're doing it on um, some of that map making stuff because then you know oh I did this and it worked or oh I did this and it didn't work it's just kind of nice to know but hopefully we can get on going uh, with our my Jules Peaceful Valley map uh, I've been doing the roads I need to do some off screen honestly or I don't know I guess I could go on and just do it but I don't want to post so much of the same thing uh, th it's just boring sometimes if you just watch it somebody lay down the same thing over and over and over because you have to lay down the markers for the for the map so to make the road I mean there's other ways of doing it don't get me wrong but just the way I'm showing right now you know you can do script to do it or you can do other ways to lay down roads so up oh, there's a deer we're gonna get you we're looking at you I'm stuck on the pole run run faster you slow hurry up not in my field what are you doing sneaky where are you going uh-huh, you thought you was going to win. You ain't going to win nothing. I'm going to catch you. Catch, clean, and cook. Wait, you're just a doe. Get out of here. Where are you going? All right, we'll quit playing with the deer. He's like, man, that lady's crazy. She's chasing me. He's going to go tell his daddy, and it'll be a buck, a buck deer, and he's going to come back and like, mm-mm. And then I'm going to say, uh, sorry. And then he's going to get a 22 or a, actually something bigger <laughs> for for coming back up over here. Then we'll do a catch, clean, cook. Have some deer meat for dinner. Mm-hmm. Ah, that's one thing that's kind of weird. They should let you run into it, but whatever. I guess they have to do that or it would jam up. We're almost done. We got almost all these up. We're getting there. Yeah. Feel free to leave a comment uh, if you have any questions or just comments if you like the video or whatever. It's always nice to hear people's comments and or answer their questions. I don't mind. Um, so just go ahead and leave a comment. And I will always read them. And if somehow they don't show up, though, I've had that a couple of times where they didn't show up. Where I saw that it says there was a comment and nothing ever showed up. No matter where I clicked, I looked all over the place. I looked in my comments section in my YouTube studio. I looked in the, on the game itself on YouTube. Like on the, uh, like if I was a normal person that didn't have the, the YouTube studio for that and was just pulling it up myself to see the comments I checked that way and it never would show so if anybody's left a comment and I didn't answer it's because it didn't show it did not show me I saw a number it said one comment and then I never could find a comment so I apologize I don't know if it what YouTube was doing if, and I checked to see if it was blocked I checked everything nothing so so I always answer comments or at least say whatever so if I can't answer it you know obviously but um, I will reply in some fashion so 
If the cell is still going on, there's a cell going on on Steam. If it's still going on, it, it, was, it was supposed to be till July 7th, so of 2022. I say that in case this this is ends up being a year later, somebody sees this video, and they'll be like, "It's supposed to be a cell. There's no cell." Okay, this is for 2022, folks. Okay, seven seven twenty-two. Got it. July seven twenty-two. All right. So, and the Trader Life game is a dollar ninety-nine plus tax if you want it. The Trader Life Simulator game, and then the Bakery Shop Simulator is a dollar forty-nine plus tax, and the Ranch Simulator is nine ninety-nine just for the game plus tax if you want the Frankenstein machinery. Uh, equipment this extra equipment that you really need to get and would like to get it's only two dollars and 49 cent plus tax but it's on sale obviously so uh, get that with the game but if you get the parker's edition that's on sale it comes with the gold rush game the franken uh stein machinery and the collector's edition Gold Rush. So I would get that one. It's $15.72 plus tax, which would be the cheapest way if you're wanting the Collector's Edition. If you don't want the Collector's Edition, then it would probably be cheaper to get just the Gold Rush game and the Frankenstein machinery. But you will want it. It has stuff you need in it, so I would get it. It's only $2.49. So get that. And if you like some other games, if you have plenty of space on your computer, and you have a good computer that'll run good. They got Planet Zoo on sale. Uh, and it's regular like $44. And it's on sale for like $13. And send some change. And then you got House Flippers on sale for about $13. I can't remember exactly. Oh, finished. And uh, uh, Lawnmower Simulator is on sale for about $13 or so as well. And there's several others that are on sale. So check it out. Uh... I sh would be getting some more on my own. I would get all of those I just named if I had more space right now. But I'm already running into some problems because my C drive is pretty full and I don't transfer it as much as I can over to D drive. And I had a, a terabyte on my D drive and a 500 gigs on my C drive, but it's still not enough for me because I'm a YouTuber and the videos are very. Uh, they take a lot of space. So anyway, so the next time we're going to do harvesting in this field. And then we might go ahead and in the same episode get this ready. Uh, I don't know. We might cultivate it and then get the stones. Then do the lime, I guess. And then be ready for whatever else we got to do. But for now, I guess we're going to call that an episode. I appreciate all the new subscribers. Like I said, if you haven't already please hit the subscribe button it's free check out the rest of the channel and watch through the playlist because it's a lot of information there i try to explain a lot of things that maybe sometimes other people might not explain there are a lot of people that explain very well uh but it's sometimes there's other channels that you might not get all the information you want so i try to be very detailed at what i tell you just to try to help you so you can learn and get some get some more out of your games and information and stuff but i appreciate everybody i'm gonna catch you on the next one please hit the like button subscribe and turn on your notification bell and i'm gonna catch you later goodbye everybody